The year 2019, they say the Dow Jones now top a remarkable one on top the political analysts. As they hold to the work of the general election, another political event, when we say they don't shape up. As the year they round up, uh, our top top person, Mary Shinda, they take us through some biggest stories for the special report. Hardly has any year been as politically anticipating and heated as the year 2019, the election year in Nigeria. Like a clash of the titans, over 90 political parties registered with INEC and at least 60 are in the number one seat, the office of Mr. President. The year kicked off with loads of political brainstorming in the camp of the major contending parties, the APC and the PDP. The APC chaired by Adam Sushamale and fielding incumbent President Muhammad Buhari and Vice President Yami Ushibajo and the PDP chaired by Uche Sakandas and fielding former Vice President Atiku Obobaka and Peter Obi in a frantic effort to clench power of the incumbent. The political space set gear in motion in January with Atiku Obobaka of the PDP making what could be described as a triumphant entry into the United States after 12 years for allegedly laundering over $40 million into the United States. The success of this trip alongside then-Senate President Bukolo Saraki was regarded by political analysts as crossing one of the most serious political hurdles on his part ahead of the presidential elections. Then, this long drama about the suspension and later the removal of the CJN Justice Walter Onoge over alleged corruption charges grabbed major news headlines as he stood trial on charges of non-declaration of assets instituted against him before the Code of Conduct Tribunal. The political permutations took a new twist with a coalition of young gladiators who believed Nigeria was ripe for a younger president. Inspired by the not-too-young-to-run movement, the young gladiators agreed to form a coalition championed by Fela Durutoye, Kingsley Mogalu, Obi Ezekwesili and Omoyele Shore, among other army of young Nigerians. But this political marriage was short-lived by a clash of interest. Former education minister and one of the two women in the presidential race, Obieza Kwesali, resigned as the presidential candidate of the Allied Congress Party of Nigeria on January the 24th, barely 21 days to the February 16 election. Like another movie suspense, hours into the election D-Day, February 16, the electoral umpire, Einek, announced the unforeseen postponement of the presidential election. The sad development sparked up a battle of words between major contending parties, the ABC and the PDP. Finally, February 21st came and INEC moved full swing into the presidential election. After days of collation, the electoral umpire declared the incumbent APC candidate President Mohamed Buhari, winner, defeating PDP's Atiku Abubaka after winning 19 states out of the 36 states, while the PDP took 17 states. Mogalo and Durotoye, who remained resilient, did not make it during the elections. The political gear, therefore, shifted to various states as Nigerians kept themselves busy with the manifestos of an avalanche of political parties and campaigns across several states. And March 9 gubernatorial election came with the APC winning Lagos State, Kaduna State, Bonu, Gombe, Jigawa, Kasina, Kebi, Kwara, Nasarawa, Niger State, Ogun State, Yobe, Zamfara, Kanu, and Plateau State. And the PDP winning states like Abia, Akwaibum, Cross River, Delta, Ebony, Enugu, Oyo, Taraba, Benue, Adamawa, Bauchi, and Sokoto. Imo State was one of the embattled states politically as the power tussle between incumbent governor Rocha Sokorocha and the party chairman Adam Zoshomele over his anointed candidate and son-in-law Uchemosu thickened. Unfortunately, the governor was thoroughly frustrated and toppled out of office as the PDP won the elections with Emeka Hedioha, a battle Okoracha didn't see losing. River State was another flashpoint, though incumbent Governor Nyesom Wike of the PDP returned elected 
It was a tough battle put up between the PDP and the APC, led by its leader in the state, Transport Minister Rotimi Amechi and his anointed candidate, Tony Cole, who in himself has a running battle with the Rivers East Senator, Magnus Abbey. In October, the Supreme Court dealt a sad blow to every ray of hope that the PDP and Atikwa Bubaka had to take over Asorok. As the apex court dismissed the appeal filed by the PDP challenging the victory of President Muhammad Buhari at the February 23rd poll. Embattled Senator Dino Milaye of the PDP was shown his way out of the Senate. He also lost a re-election for the Kogi West senatorial election rerun to his perennial rival and APC counterpart, Senator Smart Ademi. In the November 16 governorship election in Bayalsa and Kogi State, the APC defeated the PDP, adding both Bayalsa and Kogi State to its cart of victory with David Leon in Bayalsa and maintaining Governor Yahya Bello in Kogi State. As the year draws to a close, Omoyele Showere, publisher of Sahara Reporters, who hit public consciousness with his Revolution Now protest, was rearrested. His dramatic rearrest, after being granted bail by Justice Ijoma Ojuku of the Federal High Court in Abuja, is just like the running battle between the APC National Chairman Adams Oshomole and his aggrieved political son which has created the major political crescendo of political activities and epic puzzle of the year 2019. Mary Chinda for Plus TV Africa. All right, we still get a Bonga political analyst, Goshuko Ikeako, on top studio. I will watch away some young givers that I go fit uh, answer the question on top of the biggest stories for 2019. The first one we say, they say, what will be your assessment of the governance, uh, governance for Nigeria for the last one year? What if you say they don't do? Um, okay, first, uh, the three things we are going to look at, uh, because now, for what you they do, the work will they do, you get things where you go, every call, every government across yeah. the world, and three things where they anchor. Number okay. one, economy. Number two, na security. Number three, na rule of law. But if I want to flip on rule of law, na, na be the most important thing. Because okay. rule of law, na in they determine how investors they see your country. Mm. I get what they call investors climate. Say yeah. if, if, the, if, the, if the area are clear, you know, as boys, if they go somewhere, if area no clear, no go enter. Yeah. So if area are clear where, where investors feed through the money, feed do something, see what okay. that business go do. You know they. So, if we judge these people based on these three things, what I mentioned, mm. they failed. Economy bad, well, well. Bag okay. of rice, you know how much you don't reach, they don't reach 20 something K. How many okay. people get that? Minimum wage 19,000. Okay. They talk set at 20,000. How many states don't they pay them? Economy, they're bad, okay. right? People know seafood chop. People, uh, some people know they go school again. All these kinds of things. What thing politicians they do? They, they put us in more debt. Mm. Then bring security matter. We see how this country goes. See how. How tr uh, yesterday, what they had said, some one, one boss company said they kidnap people on mm. drone where they travel for Christmas. So yeah. security is for you own for this country, no too solid. You no know solid at all. Okay. All of us now inside God hand today. Okay. Even if God said don't tie for what matter for this country. So the thing we say security bad where we economy bad rule of law. It's not just say show what they talk in mind. I say as the country be say country no good. Yeah. God don't talk say make you free this guy. Make they go. The guy still the way they. You know they spend Christmas with the family. Okay. That's exactly. Then. Come across the whole country. Make we leave my, my, Buhari Mata for now. Governor of uh, uh, Cross River, Ben Ayade, he, de, he, don't, he don't imprison journalists. Now, PDP governor. Some other governors are quite on the same thing. So, would they talk, say, for this year, 2019, mm. at, for me, it'd be under the worst year we would not get as, as, as a country since we returned to democratic rule in 1999. It's okay. 20 years after. Yeah, but 20 years, that, that 20 years after, things know they better. People talk their mind. People tweet something. Kogi State Governor will imprison, imprison them. Right, so, uh, in the, no pure. the other one, they say, what you consider, say, at least, if we are the fallen, you go get one particular thing, when we say, at least, they don't do. Nothing. What be the achievement, as they want thing? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Picking where go exam, where go school. Make I ask you, picking where go school, they set this question for you, one over 10. You get one, you pass. Uh, I pass. One I, over 10. One, one over 10. Talk one thing, one they don't do. Nothing. Make a mention on sports. 
Economy. I just give you economy, rural floor, okay. infrastructure, road still bad. Okay. People they go Christmas Day on top traffic. So nothing where you go fit. The only thing where they don't do well, they say they embezzle money where well, well. right. They chop. Nothing, nothing, All nothing right. anybody go tell me. All right, you don't talk once at least. Now one thing, but the other question is one of the biggest stories of the year about the 2019 general election. How you see the way they do how I neck they do the matter. You should say they okay, I be they do rule on top of the matter. What do you get to here? Yeah. Not be me talking. All the international observers will come this election, even the last election will happen for Bayesa, Shina Bayesa, Bayesa election mm. before the 20, before Bayesa the, and Kogi. Bayesa Kogi, who see as it be? For Kogi election, and the one will pay me, but last time I come here, pay me, touch my heart. Mm. Say woman where they contest for, where, 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 they, where be party official, they, they involved in election, what will happen? Party people, they go kill him for a house. President wife will go Kogi, vice president wife will go Kogi, they don't talk anything. The following day, they give president wife award. For Abuja saying they help women. Whereas they kill woman, woman, we are full of women for Kogi saying go do election work. What in present wife don't talk to today? Nothing. But at a fly first class, carry five back, they talk plenty English for TV. They tell us saying get problem with the uh, mama, mama Daola say as far well, as make we call help and so family problem. No be like that. Election, then come back to February, March. What happened this year? People vote for this country, me and you there, for this Lagos, what we did. Or quarter they beat people where they go vote for election. Mm. So the small success we will get under Jega. This okay. most success we will get under Jega. Under Jega for 2015, people even cast votes. So they even come out the president where they this time. Okay. This one will be this year. Will be said the president not do well. We will see all of us come, come out, go vote. People not come out because the intimidation plenty. So election itself failed. International observers from US, from EU, all the people will come, talk, say, see what thing happen. I just give you the last election. They kill woman. Okay. We'll go, not, she not do anything. Her job says she just go do what she's supposed to do. As it is, what thing that happen? Kogi governor constantly deny the matter. So you mean say the election fail, Abi? Fair and understatement. If you get into way pass, well, if you use for qualify, you fail because election where keep people, where yeah. people die, where they intimidate okay. people for Lagos State. You see what okay. happened for Kota. All right, uh, thank you very much. I see.